30% of students at Metro Public Schools consider Spanish their primary language. As we celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month, New Channel 5's Olivia Michael introduces us to one new school in Southeast Nashville working to eliminate language barriers in the classroom. A new country, a new language, a challenge hard enough for adults. But it's one some of these children are facing too. Parents Isaac and Natalie recently moved from Venezuela. Lucas tiene seis años. Este es un niño muy inteligente. They say in the short time they've been here, their six-year-old son Lucas already knows several words and phrases in English. El proceso de transición definitivamente ha sido mm -hmm. muy positivo. They say the transition has been a positive one. For them to be able to come to school, not only the students be able to speak in their language and be understood, but their parents to be able to communicate directly with the teacher and the teacher communicate directly in the language that the parents understand makes really just such a difference. Natalie Morosi is one of the founders of this bilingual project-based Aventura Community School. Aventura has just kind of been a collective dream of so many people in our community for a really long time. Here, 80% of class is taught in Spanish. Yo sufro muchísimo cuando voy a un sitio. Odalis says she suffers when she goes somewhere that she can't be understood. Now her daughter won't have that problem. The benefits of having a diverse population is that both of the populations benefit. So our English speakers benefit from learning with our Spanish speakers and vice versa. Right now, the school is kindergarten through first grade. We have families who have kids in the, in the tummy. My baby's not born yet, but I'm trying to figure out about your school. But a new grade will be added each year, something families look forward to as Nashville's Hispanic community continues to grow. Ready, set, go. Olivia Michael, News Channel 5.